Hey, how's it going? This is Drew from Cottage Gardens in Lansing, Michigan. Hope you're having a great day so far. I'm talking about the Ruby Falls Weeping Red Bud. It's going to get to a max height of 8 feet tall by 6 feet wide. It's going to do really well in either full sun or uh, full shade. Uh, in warmer climates, though, you're going to want to keep it primarily in the shade. Uh, that's just to kind of prevent it. Um, any kind of like leaf scorch or anything else is going to keep the soil nice and moist, nice and cool. The kind of flower that it's going to have is a very lavender red. Uh, it's going to come around like April or early May. And then the kind of uh, foliage that it's going to have is a very uh, burgundy, kind of heart-shaped uh, type of leaf. It's also going to be considered walnut tolerant. So if you have it near a walnut tree, you don't have to worry about that toxicity that it might get with other trees. And then you're going to want to water it pretty regularly. Uh, um, and then when, that's just to help it kind of get more established. And when you go to plant it, use a little bit of mulch around the roots. And then use some terrazorb in the mulch. And that's really going to help just get better established and keep it, much, keep it a lot more uh, healthier. And the kind of growth habit that it's going to have is very weeping. Kind of a very droopy looking kind of growth habit. And it's also going to prefer more alkaline soils compared to more acidic soils. Uh, so you don't want to have it too, you obviously don't want to have it too acidic, but you want to keep it pretty uh, well balanced between normal and alkaline. So if you have more questions, go ahead and ask one of our sales staff. You can go ahead and ask me. Thank you so much. Bye.